Hi everybody. Okay, on my doorstep today, I was super excited because we had delivered the Good and the Beautiful Level K Math Activity Box. We have not gotten the, um, the book yet for this, but I kind of wanted to go through the Math Activity Box with you and just kind of see what the contents of this is. Um, yeah, I want to show you all the Good and the Beautiful things that are in here. Uh, so, okay, so to start out, this is what you're going to see. There's a bunch of stuff in here. Um, it's all so pretty. This is the colored blocks. Um, just simple wood blocks, but those are really nice. There's a little wreck and wreck here for counting. There are, let's see here. Oh, these are really cool. Okay. These are really nice baggies. They actually provide you with labeled baggies for all of the manipulatives. So I actually don't have to go through and get my own baggies and try to make my own um, labels. These ones are already labeled for you for all of the manipulative pieces. Um, here is the My Place value chart. This is pretty cool because it actually um, just opens right up. It's double, double hinged there. Um, there's all these little pockets in here. I'm not entirely sure how these are going to be used yet, but we'll find out as soon as the curriculum comes, um, the actual workbook. But um, yeah, this, I'm excited to see what that does. There is my little calendar here. So inside, there is an About Me page. And then I think this is about how all of the pages look for the months. So you got January. February, March, um, looks like there's a little poem right here. Um, March wind is a jolly fellow. He likes to joke and play. He turns umbrellas inside out and blows men's hats away. He calls the pussy willows and whispers in each ear, wake up you lazy little seeds. Don't you know that spring is here? So on each month, there's just something really cool that is said, uh, maybe a little poem or um, just something fun. So that is the calendar. Then, let's see here, I'm gonna set this aside real quick. Um, these are the things that you get to punch out. So here are your pattern blocks. And those are, this is what is gonna go inside your pattern block baggie that they already provided for you. So I know that that seems kind of silly to be excited about the baggies, but it takes one more step out of the prep work for me. The fact that they have already provided this in the box. So that is for that. And they actually, oh, <laughs> and it looks like they're really easy to punch out because they just fell out. Some of them did. So yeah, that's actually very nice. They're nice and uh, well punched. So you're not having to sit there and hope that you're not tearing any of it. Um, but those are going to go with the homes match the pattern blocks, little pages here. So um, as you can see, you're going to build a little house on this page. Um, this one, you get to build a duck. This one, you make a heart. And these are double sided too. So you're getting bang for your buck right here. Um, and these are nice and thick and they're just beautifully illustrated. So you're going to build a puppy and a turtle, and this one's a bat. These are really cool, and I can guarantee that my son, who's going into kindergarten this fall, is going to absolutely love these. Then, let's see here what else there's in the box. Okay, so these are all of the, the garden and the bee manipulatives. If you looked through um, any of the preview of it, I know that they use the bee manipulatives a lot, so, um, I'm, I'm excited to get these all punched out and once again, they have the baggies provided for these so you can keep them separated. And then let's see what else is in here. Okay, they provided a bunch of toothpicks and I love that it actually came in a nice little case. You just spin the little flower top so you can get your toothpick out that way. And I know that seems silly to be excited about that, but you guys, all of my toothpicks currently are in a plastic baggie in my drawer and they just spill out all over the place. And um, so this is actually kind of nice and handy to have it that way. Uh, let's see what else. Um, okay, these are your place value pieces. So there's that. Um, this one you do have to cut out. It says that you have to cut everything out on the dark line there. So that is gonna involve a little bit of work with having to cut all of that out. Then 
then they have these beautiful punched lamb, or I guess they're not laminated, but they're really nice card stock. They're glossy on one side and then matte on the other, or matte-ish on the other. Um, so these are all the numbers. So these are numbers, numbers, and then you get into your odds and your evens. Oh, and then it looks like you start getting into some counting practice with these. I'll be honest, I'm not entirely sure how to use these just yet, but all I know is that these look very nice and the quality is really good. These are nice and stout. My five-year-old is not going to bend these super easily. They are, they're very good quality. And it looks like we got a bunch of shape cards which these will be really nice. I can use these with my preschooler. She's two currently and she's still learning all of her shapes. So this will be perfect to use these with her. Um, and that's just the cardboard that it comes on. And then there's one other thing that came in the box and it's a handwriting card. And this is for um, practicing your numbers. So the little star I'm assuming is just where you start at on the card. And on the back, it actually gives you a place to practice writing your phone number. So, um, and this is nice laminated. It's actually a real thick laminate. Um, so yeah, this is great. And like I said, I am just super excited to try this. I know this is, this is the first year that this has come out. Um, so I'm curious to see what everyone else thinks of it once the curriculum starts rolling. Um, so I guess let me know your thoughts on it. I am really excited to start it. And like I said, my son, when he saw it, said, Mommy, can we start this today? And unfortunately, I had to tell him that the workbook hadn't come yet and that we will just start it soon. So if he's wanting to start a little bit early, I am totally game for that. But it is summer and it is absolutely gorgeous outside. So I definitely want to take advantage of that too. So uh, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this.